the Formosan Association for Public Affairs celebrated its 40th anniversary on Monday in a star-studded event attended by Taiwan's president and vice president. Also in attendance was visiting dignitary John Bolton, a former U.S. national security advisor. In a speech, Bolton slammed China for its provocations and urged the U.S. to grant diplomatic recognition to Taiwan. United Microelectronics Corporation founder Robert Tsao created a buzz saying that embracing the Republic of China was like wearing a dead person's burial clothing. The Formosan Association for Public Affairs held its 40th anniversary banquet on Monday with President Tsai Ing-wen, Vice President Lai Qingde, and former U.S. National Security Advisor John Bolton in attendance. UMC founder Robert Tsao gave a surprising speech. I have never been pro-unification. I have always been pro-independence. The ROC is dead in mainland China, so isn't holding on to the symbols of the ROC kind of like wearing a burial garment? They don't let us take off our grave clothes. Why? It's because they want to trick Taiwan into accepting one country, two systems. There's only one country that aims to change the status quo in the region, and that's China. Military to military cooperation needs to be cooperation between our intelligence agencies. Bolton underscored China's threat in the region. He also called for cooperation between Taiwan and the U.S., adding that Washington should establish official ties with Taipei. President Tsai reiterated the importance of peace and stability across the Taiwan Strait. Through its military drills, China is intentionally escalating tensions, which pose a threat to the peace and stability of the Indo-Pacific region. We respond in a calm and collective manner and remain committed to maintaining peace in the Taiwan Strait. That has allowed Taiwan's democratic partners to see Taiwan's resolve. We are all members of Team Taiwan. Peace is priceless. In war, there are no winners. Taiwan can be a key force in the Indo-Pacific region. It's only by preparing for war that we can prevent war and maintain peace. <laughs> With Tsai touting Team Taiwan and spirited cheering from the crowd, the banquet felt like a campaign rally for Lai, the DPP's presidential candidate. Officials stressed the need to strengthen Taiwan-U.S. ties to counter China's growing threat.